Good evening, I'm a stay certified instructor. I teach teens and adults. We're gonna go ahead and talk about a night drive. Uh, we're on a road near a school in a huge uh, rural area. So I'm gonna look over my shoulder, put in drive, and you can see, hopefully with the night vision and the dash cam, give me some feedback if you like this, you like this type of content. So we're gonna come up. We got a double yellow. This means that you cannot change lanes. You got an edge line to the right, which means that is the edge of the road. So this is a double left, excuse me, a double right turn. We're in the outside. So we're gonna go up to the edge. We're gonna have a complete stop behind the stop line. And then once you stop, you're gonna go up to the edge and check traffic. So we're just waiting. Uh, if we have to move forward to activate the signals and if we don't move forward, it will stay. So here's a gap. A gap is the space. I'm gonna go ahead and complete my turn. And then I stay to the left. I'm gonna make a left-hand turnaround. Got my left turn signal on. I'm looking ahead as you can see. Hopefully you can see me pretty good. And then I'm gonna go ahead and make that turn, and I turn hand over hand in the inside lane, and I turn out hand over hand. So that's a pretty good turn. I'm gonna try to adjust this a little bit. Seems to be a little bit better. Go try to adjust it. Yeah, that should be a little bit better. So I'm gonna go up there to the stop line. Screen, I look left and right, and I'm just building up my speed. The speed limit here is 55 miles an hour. Continue. You can hear the motor kind of picking up a little bit. Uh, usually, night drivers, beginning night drivers, it's very overwhelming. It's really hard for you to orientate yourself. You're going to be drifting to the left, drifting to the right. You've got to learn to keep your balance good speed control and be patient. I'm checking my mirror as you can tell. In fact, I'm going to adjust it a little bit. Adjust it. So when you have your mirror suggested, you can see out of the rear window. I don't know if you can see my eye movement. Let me know if you can or you can't. I do have a car in my blind spot to my right. So you don't want to hide a car's blind spots. 